Hi, today I'm going to do a very short video review on the second part of the uh, Mini Omega Solar Flood Light. Okay? In conjunction with uh, SC Origin 6 year anniversary, uh, we have launched the uh, Mini Omega uh, Solar Flood Light. Okay? Uh, under the uh, Solar Light Mark. Okay? Um, let me just touch a bit uh, on the concept of the Mini, okay? The Mini actually is something that we want a solar flood light that is lightweight, okay? So that, you know, you can bring it around, okay? Compact, for example, the battery banks uh, is inside here, alright? The charge controller is inside here. The pulse technology for the LED driver is also inside here. Okay, and the whole thing is weight less than 3 kg. Okay, and we also want it to be easy to operate. All you have to do is actually uh, to plug in the solar panel and put the solar panel outside uh, under the sun. Uh, it will charge, you know, the battery uh, inside the mini. Okay and easy to operate for example at the back there you have two on off uh, two switches one is just the on off switch okay okay the on off switch okay the other one is the intensity uh, brightness intensity switch as you can see right now this is a 50% intensity and 100% intensity all right okay so 50% and 100% for the 100% intensity the light, uh, the flood light will light out for roughly about five hour. Okay, uh, this is very good, especially let's say you use this uh, for businesses, for example, lighting up your signboard. Uh, five hour uh, at hundred percent intensity is good enough. All right, but let's say if you want to light up uh, your house compound or your garden or uh, for your backyard for security reason, you can turn this for um, fifty percent as intensity. And it will light up uh, roughly about uh, 10 hours, yeah? Okay, and uh, probably I want to touch a bit on the technology itself, okay? Um, the Mini actually using a very advanced uh, battery technology. We call it the Fusion technology, okay? Uh, because it's a Fusion uh, battery, that means it's combined of uh, different kinds of battery materials, uh, battery chemical, and form a new generation of battery, uh, whereby it's very, very lightweight and it's very, very compact, okay? You can fit in this here and lightweight, and also it can charge uh, faster. For solar, it's charging, it's always, we call it the opportunity charging. When the sun come out, the cloud block it, and the sun come out again, then oh, it started to rain. So the time to charge, uh, the battery is always uh, very limited, so that's why we call it opportunity charging. And because of that, uh, we not we need the battery can be charged uh, at a very fast rate. So the fusion technology, uh, battery technology, can give us this uh, this way to charge. Okay, and talk about charging. Uh, the charge is always come. Uh, the power is always coming from the sun. Uh, from the solar panel, uh, this mini will be charged. Okay. Um, we are using a supercell uh, solar panel uh, because of su supercell solar panel has been used. Uh, the solar panel is very small, roughly about the size of this flood light. Okay, and because of supercell is being used, the charging rate is much faster compared to other uh, solar panel. Is because uh, better efficient. All right, and we also want to touch about the. Uh, charge controller. The charge controller used for this system is actually is the state of the art and the legendary Gamma charge controller technology. Okay, we embedded the Gamma uh, charge controller technology inside this guy. All right, so that you know you can you know give a good charge and protect the battery and perform all kind of uh, lighting function. Okay, like for example, automatic turn on the light uh, during the night, automatic shut down you know the light. Uh, when you know, the battery is low or in the morning, the, you, know, you, you need to shut down the light okay? and to protect the battery. And also, uh, we also using our pulse technology, okay? pulse uh, driver technology to uh, power the LED so that uh, the LED can consume very little power okay? 
very little power and can also give you the uh, strong brightness or very bright okay this guy actually produce uh, let's say at 100% intensity it will give you roughly about uh, 600 lumen and it's good enough for a lot of uh, businesses or application but let's say you turn it to at 50% uh, intensity you still get a uh, roughly about 300 lumens okay uh, that also good enough let's say uh, you cover a uh, certain area uh, I, I believe that you guys already watched the first video and we have shown you that uh, it's very good in uh, a lot of uh, lighting application okay and of course you can't compare the mini uh, Omega against the big brother, the uh, uh, solar Omega Fert Light, the SC at at zero, because those are industrial grade uh, solar system. Uh, we have built that for military purpose. Uh, that's why is the brightness is three times more uh, than this guy, and of course, um, you know, it's also very pricey. But of course, the standpoint, the the, the strong point of the mini itself is is lightweight compact and you know uh, it's affordable not to mention okay the selling part is, is affordable is compact is lightweight you can bring around this let's say you go for a picnic you want to light up you, you, you can bring it out because it's lightweight and it's compact let's say it's power shortage or breakout you know no no electric no light you can use this guy to power up but let's say it's let's say some emergency or you, you want to have light you can just bring around this guy and you know turn on the light okay the light up uh, things like that so what we'll try to stress is actually the mini is a new kind of uh, concept of lighting and um, is very mobile and uh, it's affordable you, you can uh, mount it uh, any place that, uh, that you like okay uh, this is just uh, our part 2 of the video uh, but of course uh, we will prepare a part 3 as well and I will show you more on the part 3. Thanks.